I told y'all I was coming right the fuck back as soon as this shit was over. As soon as this shit was over. The only thing that I will say is I did not get a chance, <clears throat> based off the early release, to catch clips of the reunion. But you know what? I'll just wait. I will fucking wait to talk about this motherfucking uh, reunion, like I said. <clears throat> and hopefully somebody spills the tea and I get the shit early. But we'll see. So... <clears throat> We all here. What's going on, everybody? So, hey, hey, <laughs> we 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 finna talk about this shit now. First, let me say, this was one of the most boring. <laughs> I told, <laughs> hey, 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 I ain't the Lord, but I told y'all I was gonna be here. Hey, putting. So we we gonna talk about this shit. First and foremost, was it just me, or did it seem like they just threw this shit together? <clears throat> Because on some real shit, it the season started out real good, and in love and hip hop fashion, the shit sizzled. <clears throat> but normally, you look to the season finale to give you something, and the something we really didn't. I'll talk about why we didn't get the something at the very end, but I wasn't here for it. So, <laughs> so I said, "Check it all right now." Somebody, you know it. it I didn't see the tweet because I really went on Twitter all that much, but yeah, exactly. They, they threw this shit together, but but we gonna talk all shit smoke break in the house. What's up, Biber? What's up, Biber? So let's just go ahead and talk about the shit, and I'ma somewhat go play by play, and we gonna talk, you know. And I, I want y'all to be interactive with me, cause you, cause y'all know I'm, I'm about, <laughs> cause y'all know I'm about to show my ass on this motherfucker, okay? Hey, boo. So let's go ahead and start out with Moniz and Rich. Now, <clears throat> it, it ended real quick. I really thought this shit probably would have went on a little bit longer, but it is what it is. You know, I know I should have watched Gotham. I got to get caught up on Gotham Flash and Arrow. I I will admit that, and I'm pretty sure Gotham was good. But don't 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 spill it for me, cause I'm gonna say that shit for Wednesday, probably tomorrow night. I don't know, but I'm gonna watch that shit later. All right. <clears throat> So, Rich and motherfucking Moniz. Now, Moniz regrets confessing her heart to Fizz. You fucking think? Like, I'm sitting here trying to figure out, like, in what world is that even fucking okay? You know what I'm saying? Oh, okay, well, go on. Go ahead and get your black ink in now. Like I said, I'm going I'm to do it. If I don't get to it tonight, y'all get it tomorrow. But I, I want to come on here and love on y'all for a minute now. But that's cool. That's cool. I understand. I ain't mad. But her, um, <clears throat> I'm just trying to feel like, why would you confess that to him? You know what I'm saying? Oh, now we know she crazy now. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know I love me some Moniz. I'm here for I'm team Moniz. I'm probably the only motherfucker in YouTube land that's team Moniz. But, you know, I'm just like, why would you do that? And then if you do that, why would you do it on camera? I, it was a beautiful moment, like I said, and like I said, hopefully y'all saw my review. If y'all didn't, like I said, it is uh, up online. I had that shit out early. I told y'all I was doing. I was actually smoke. She should have kept that shit to herself. She should. Oh, you got black in the background. Now I was watching <clears throat> Smoke Breaks uh, Periscope. She was periscoping earlier, and she can attest to this. And y'all, y'all know I gotta find the shit. I got a little searching, and the shit came up. Oh, he messy as fuck. We ain't gonna deny that. And I saw the shit was available. I told her I, I gotta go because I gotta watch this shit. It was an early fucking release now. <clears throat> you know, you, you know what though? I will say this. I do think that they will work for each other. <clears throat> Cause my whole thing is on some real shit. Even though she cray as hell, cray as hell. My thing is this: Do you want natural or do you want artificial? That's all the fuck I'ma say. Regardless if the bitch crazy or not. Do you want, you know, pure or artificial? Do you want naturally built or you know Mattel built? That's all the fuck I'm saying. <clears throat> you know what? Probably. Probably. But you know she going through some shit now. Exactly natural all day. See, <clears throat> on some real shit, I think Moniz has enough shrimp to put him on his ass on some real shit. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm not going to say he's completely over her. I don't know if he's completely over her. I think it's still some shit that I think he's just scared to go back there with her. Oh, shit, Dollar Tree built. The shade is real tonight, y'all. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> Again, y'all be saying my ass is bad. <laughs> y'all bad. <laughs> but that shit was funny as hell, though. I ain't even gonna fucking lie. Now, one thing I will say is the whole ring talk. One thing that I didn't like is apparently, you know, Moniz have been bringing up rings and shit. I'm trying to figure out why the fuck did Rich think it was okay? I got you. Why did um, <clears throat> Rich think it's okay to joke? What's up, what? To joke with her about rings and shit. She does need therapy. I've said that in my video. She does need therapy. Because here's the thing. Actually, let me finish it. I'm going to come back to that. But, you know, he wants to joke with her about, you know, rings and shit. And it's just like, <clears throat> he sees that she is slightly unstable. And like I said, I like one of these. I've already said that. But it's certain shit you don't joke with somebody about, especially when you know that sometimes they're not all the way there. <clears throat> now, in terms of therapy, something happened. She need, you know what his thing? Does she need to be a mother first? Yes. But I will say this. <clears throat> The whole entire story has not been told. There are gaps. I swear for Lord, there's some gaps. Because, see, all y'all agree with Woody. <laughs> but here's what I need for y'all <clears throat> to understand. There's three sides. There's actually four sides to this story. There's Monisa's side, Fizz's side, there's Marla's side, and then there is the truth. <clears throat> they need to get all three of their asses on the fucking reunion, on stage with whomever... Oh, I'm going to take up for what I told y'all. I'm team on these. I am. But what I'm saying is they need to get all of them on stage and let all three of them talk about the situation. Because then only then we really figure out what the fuck has happened. But I'm not convinced that Moniz is as absentee of a mother as they have painted her out to be. Plus, at the same exact time, <clears throat> you can tell. But you can tell by, you know, watching this and everything. We, we, oh shit, we gifted. We, <laughs> but you know, fuck, y'all done made me lose my train of thought. <laughs> Whatever, it is what the fuck it is. But again, I am fucking Team Moniz. But again, I'm gonna call her out when she's fucking wrong. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna call her out when she's wrong. But I don't think that she's been that fucking absent. And this is what I was gonna say. If you guys really watch it, she purposely wasn't mentioning, <clears throat> it's all good, she wasn't mentioning. Uh, Cameron, because I don't think that she was trying to make Cameron her storyline, because <clears throat> she had other shit to talk about. You feel what I'm saying? But it was Marla that wanted to make her motherfucking interest. I don't motherfucking know why. And Fizz really didn't have shit going on, so he also made Cameron the storyline. Because I was happy. I was fucking happy with them not even talking about it. And if I can go ahead and talk about <clears throat> Fizz right quick. Let, let me talk about this bitch made motherfucker. Y'all remember that one episode, I think it was the last fucking episode, that he sat out with Rich, right? I'm just I'm just saying, okay. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. But but here's the thing. <clears throat> y'all remember, okay, y'all remember when Phil was just like, I wanna sit here and I wanna see you know who um she's what dude she's gonna have around Cameron. <clears throat> I felt some kind of motherfucking way. I think I'm the only motherfucker that said it. I have not watched everybody's videos because y'all know my ass just got back in Saturday afternoon. But I'ma say this. <clears throat> so it's okay for you to have, you know, you know, your Applebee appetizer, your chili appetizer, and you know your motherfucking McDonald, you know, dollar menu ass bitches around your motherfucking son. And that's okay, especially the motherfucker one. I, I, I ain't got time to read, don't, but forgive me, because I got something, but you can fucking do that, and that's okay. <clears throat> you can have this bitch who you claim to be a fucking appetizer in your house around your motherfucking son, and can't nobody say shit to you. I, I, I suddenly hear anybody clown his ass for that, but now you want to sit here and jump on his bandwagon talking about some rich don't need to be around motherfucking camera. Y'all can miss me with that motherfucking bullshit, because my thing is, why is it okay for him to do the fuck shit just because just be fucking cuz he's taking care of Cameron it don't make that shit right exactly Th thank you I'm, I'm glad y'all see I, I'm gonna I'm talk about the shit okay I, I'm gonna talk about the, yes I am I'm definitely here for Moniz but Moniz is fucked up in many kind of motherfucking way and I'm gonna talk about 
some of how she's fucked up. Trust what I say, I'm going to give you both. But I am fucking Team Moniz. But that's some shit that didn't nobody want to fucking talk about. And I hope that shit comes up on the motherfucking reunion. I really fucking do. Because like I said, Fizz is a bitch made motherfucker. I don't care what none of y'all fuck. You know what? Let me calm down. Cause I'm about to say some shit. <laughs> I had to catch myself because I was going to say some shit. I, I, I'm trying to be nice tonight, okay? He He's very much so a hypocrite. So I'm going to leave them alone for now. What what the fuck happened with Miles, okay? <clears throat> okay. Barely like anybody on show. Like I said, I think, like I said, the only person that I really... Oh, shout out to Dave. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh, <laughs> I swear, y'all, y'all cut the fuck up. Ooh, I would make myself a Long Island bottom, ran out of fucking soda, and I don't feel like playing with the damn soda stream right now. But that's all right, that's all right. It's okay. We, we gonna do this shit slightly inebriated and shit. <laughs> all right, so I'm not gonna talk about Miles right now. I'm come back to him. So let's talk about Ray J, y'all. Let's talk about Ray J, because I need for y'all to sit here and chime in on a question that I have, okay? So first, <clears throat> you know what? He shouldn't get brownie points. He should not get brownie points for doing what the fuck he's supposed to do as a fucking father. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> Milan sounds like I'm too deep, but... <laughs> now nah, we're going to talk about Ray J. We're we, we going to talk about Ray J. So... <clears throat> He now he has already been friend zoned by um fucking uh I, her name not Angel what the princess I don't know why the fuck Angel came to my motherfucking head with shit princess sound like a strip motherfucking name anyway but um so he is friend zoned now he want to sit here yeah I know brand little brother want to sit here and buy a house to try to sit here and win princess back like I'm just like damn. His ass is thirsty as all motherfucking get up. You feel what I'm saying? But now we had Princess say to him, I'll take the, I'll come back with the whole house situation as long as you put it in my name. Now, this is what I want us to talk about. Is she smart for that or is she dumb for that? Okay. Yeah, mm, acting like new money, and but I, I want I want y'all to answer that first before I kind of weigh in on it because it, it has me feeling some kind of way over this bad boy. Smart, dumb, okay. Well, here's the thing, <clears throat> because for me, I think she's both smart for it, but has the potential to be dumb, and here's why I say that. It's smart because, all right, if he start getting on that fuck shit, he cannot put you out of a house that is in your name. You feel what I'm saying? That's what I'm scared to do. But here's the thing. Mm, oh no. But here's the one thing that gets me. What happens if he's paying the fucking mortgage? He can sit here and hold this shit over her head and... By the looks of it, he has more of a steady income <clears throat> than she does. All right, make, make sure it's paid in full. I, and I, I got that. And I, and I see where she's coming from, too. Ex but here's the thing. If she can't pay for it, it's one of those things where it's like she will always be in servitude to him. And I got to put it on paper. But come on, we've been watching Princess this whole entire time. She not playing with a full fucking deck. She not. I mean, the Jokers ain't there. The Deuces ain't there. She missing the King, Queen, and the... Well, actually, the Joker's still in there. But she missing the King, Queen, and the motherfucking Jack because ain't shit raw about this motherfucking princess. Hell, she don't even know she got a motherfucking crown because she right here acting like a motherfucking peasant. I'm just saying. But, hey, if that's what the fuck she want to... Mmm, shit. <laughs> what do you... I swear you... Ooh, you be trying it, bro. It's more like rent, not mortgage. Okay, okay. It is. <laughs> it's least in that. I'm just trying to figure out where he got all his money because he didn't went from this apartment that he had to wherever the fuck he lived. And now he didn't went and bought this. I know his pockets ain't that motherfucking wide. I know his pockets ain't that wide. All right. I'm pretty sure Brandy got more residual money than this motherfucker do. I'm just saying because all her shit was syndicated and he was featured on some of her syndicated shit. Just saying. <clears throat> but before we move on. To Richard Dollars, 
Is that all we got? To, oh, he got a loan from Brandon. <laughs> is, is that all we want to talk about about <clears throat> Mr. Ray J and Princess Love for the moment? For the moment. All right, I guess we can go ahead and uh, talk about uh, Rich and uh, Tamar's uh, twin sister and shit. Okay. <clears throat> Just like Stevie J and Jocelyn. When does uh, Stevie J and Jocelyn come out? Because I, I want to watch it. I know it's going to be some put together shit, but I really want to watch Father, what? You know what? <laughs> you ain't right. I swear. <laughs> I can't with you sometimes. I can't. But your ass funny as hell. All right. <clears throat> so, Rich. Let's go ahead and talk about him. Rich and Tamar's sister. Next month. Bad. One more. Which I <laughs> so <clears throat> Rich and fucking Tamar sister. I did not like this at all. I was so fucking against it. I really was. And <clears throat> cause like I said, you know, fashion shit don't really care about that. But what really got me is I need for Tamar's sister to sit here and be an upstanding woman and own her shit. You feel what I'm saying? <clears throat> like, own her shit. She fucking do. Look at her and her motherfucking confessionals. Then watch Angels and Demons when, when Tamar floating on the motherfucking boat and tell me them motherfuckers are one of their motherfucking twins. I'm just fucking saying. Don't, don't. <laughs> exactly. I'm just saying, hey, y'all can sit here and call me Master Shady Well. For I know what the fuck I'm talking about. Don't make me sit here and come on a reunion show with side by side picture. I'ma fucking do it just for y'all, cause y'all think I'm playing. What you mean you came with me? I'm telling the fucking truth. Okay, I I got I ain't got shit to lie about. Okay, I'm I'm gonna sit here and I'm I'm giving y'all my damn truth. Okay, we all of us over here cutting up. Okay, I ain't the only one. Hell. Anyway, <laughs> what the fuck else I was saying, y'all? <laughs> you don't watch <laughs> anyway anyway I mean for, what's GP I, 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 I honestly don't know what GP is <laughs> okay but um so she decides that like what I need her to do is like like own her shit you feel what i'm saying like truly own her shit and this is what i mean <clears throat> I, we all saw what happened with monies we all saw monies being messy as fuck okay oh i i'm 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 a you know demetria mckinney i'm gonna keep it 100 but i understand you know monies is a fuck shit the last two fucking episodes and she's done some shit that wasn't really cool you feel what i'm saying <clears throat> oh okay okay but here's the thing that got me. If you your whole purpose for telling Rich was because I want to get her back for fucking up my fucking fashion show, then that's one thing. You know, own your shit. You feel what I'm saying? Like I said, if you're gonna be messy, live in it. Own your shit. But don't sit here and be like, oh well, you know, because I feel that Rich needs to know that ain't it. That ain't it. Don't 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 lie to us. Don't lie to your motherfucking self. You feel what I'm saying? Cause it wasn't shit but a fucking lie. I wasn't here for it at all. Not at all. Whoo, the brush. Be something off her ass here. <clears throat> I'm just saying, but that shit was messy to know. Like, here's the thing, yeah. Fizz was wrong, because Fizz shouldn't have said shit to her. But at the same exact time, she should not have opened her fucking mouth at the fuck all. <clears throat> we could sit here and run a Rolodex of shit that people could have ran back and said on fucking Nikki, but ain't nobody fucking said shit. You feel what I'm saying? My thing is, if you finna sit here and stir the motherfucking pie, be ready to defend your motherfucking self. Any fucking way. The fuck else I got? <clears throat> what you mean? I don't look... Wait, what? Oh, wait. Oh, I'm about to say, I didn't say shit. <laughs> all right. So, <clears throat> let's go ahead and move on to Miles and his motherfucking family. Wait. Okay, here's the thing. Ken wait, 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 whoa. Yes, Kenya is fucking messy. Shady boots all the motherfucking way. Like I said, you know, and I like fucking Kenya. She, you know, she breathes life into, you know, fucking real housewives. But what I will say is this. 
Kenya, for what is worth, owns the fucking shit that she does. And she, like, on the last fucking episode, talking about some, let's throw her. <laughs> I'll be 29 next month, okay? But, when, like, when she said, oh, we gonna throw Sheree a rent party, she knew what the fuck she was doing. I said she was shady for that shit. It was funny as fuck. But she owns the shit that she says and the shit that she does. She fucking owns it. Unlike. Unlike fucking Tamar's sister. That's all the fuck that I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I said, again, I'm gonna call a motherfucking spade a spade. You feel what I'm saying? The only person that y'all truly see me on here defending is fucking Monique. 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 Lord, I... Fuck, what is wrong with me today? <laughs> Any fucking way. So let's get on the mouths of his motherfucking family. Alright, because I'm I know y'all got some shit to say. <clears throat> so... Okay, we just gonna cut to the meat and potatoes of that shit. Okay, so y'all know Milan came on in and shit. And I did not like how they... Now, we all know this was a fucking reenactment, okay? Like, let's just say that. I will go up for my niece. I think I'm the only one that is doing that. And I will be the only one, okay? All right. They were well past hostile. <laughs> I'm supposed to is motherfucking strong face, man. Like, I can't. <laughs> Which is from the <laughs> Oh, shit. Ooh. Hold on now. Ooh, hold on. I gotta catch my breath on now. <laughs> but it's just like, <clears throat> you know, I kind of, like, with the mother... She kind of pulled a fucking Marla on us, like, pretty much ran his fucking whole facts. Which is perfectly fucking fine, but my whole thing is this. He is a grown motherfucking man. Your son is a grown motherfucking man. How dare you sit here and come at any motherfucking body? And my thing is this. Hold on now. <laughs> pull that fly back, but no. It's just like, she can't act like they ain't never fucking did anything. <laughs> exactly, like, like your past is fucking squeaky clean. Again, the only difference is, you know, they probably didn't have motherfucking internet and cell phones and shit when your ass was motherfucking coming up. Highly doubt they probably had motherfucking money for motherfucking magazines and shit. Exactly, the same exact fucking shit. But it's like, you try to protect your son from what? You feel what I'm saying? I, I I got it. That's what mu I got it. That's what mamas do. But I think she came at him a little too motherfucking incorrectly. My thing is, if you're gonna sit here and check Milan, then you need to be checking Miles for some of the fuck shit that his ass been doing since his stringing, you know, simple matter bitches alone. Okay, I didn't like that. Now I will say I think that Milan handled himself maturely, even though that shit was staged. <laughs> he probably did. He should have threw that shit out there. But he handled that a hell of a lot better than I would have. Because I probably would have sat here. And I'm sorry. I would have been motherfucking disrespectful to her ass. On some real shit. And had she, and had she even with that hoe, I'm on up to be your mama. Uh, guess what, bitch? My mama's on up to be your motherfucking mama. That's some shit that I would say. Okay, because you're you not finna sit here and come for me, especially when I'm a grown-ass man, man, grown-ass sister, and paying my own motherfucking bills, and I'm paying some of your son's motherfucking bills. You're not finna do it. You're not. I know. Like I said, again, this shit is all stage. We, we, we're just talking and conversating. You know what I'm saying? And, and, <clears throat> again. And then, my whole thing is this. Why did his sister turn up like that? I'm just trying to figure out, like... Like, what was it? I, I watched Lady Nika's, you know, uh, review, because I actually sent her the link, personally. <clears throat> but she did make a good point. It was almost just like a color purple to you do right by my son type of thing. But it's just like, why the fuck you going in the way that you going in on this man? You feel what I'm saying? Again, he handled that shit stage, whatever, way better than I would have. Because I would have turned into a disrespectful son of a bitch on some real shit, like... Because here's the thing, I will respect my elders, but uh, respect is like communication. That shit is a two-way motherfucking street. You not finna come at me motherfucking crazy. You not finna fucking do that. 
you not finna do that. Because as soon as you do, we on the same motherfucking playing field. Cause I'm about to sit here and talk about your house, your hair, your strong motherfucking face, how you, how, you, with whatever genes you got, your motherfucking door looking just as strong face, your motherfucking son, you not finna fucking do that. You not. You not. <laughs> I ain't that dude. I am not that dude. Y'all think I'm playing? If y'all ever get a chance to meet, if I can ever convince my mother to get on fucking camera. My mother would tell you I've been like this my whole entire life. Like I'm very fucking combatant. You not you not finna come me fucking crazy. You're just not finna do it. Well, I mean, yeah, they, they found the right one. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. All right. All right. Oh lord, y'all. I swear, y'all worse than me. Shit. Exactly. Exactly. That boy be cutting up, y'all. Ooh. Yeah. All right. So, I think that's all I want to talk about 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 those two holes. <clears throat> and on some real shit, I'm glad I have stayed off of social media because I miss a lot of they fucking internet, you know, theatrics. And I don't know what the fuck been going on with them. <laughs> you know, so I don't know what's really been going on with them. But like I said. I think that's really all that I can give to them. I still have to talk about Milan just for a slight second. But let's go ahead and get into Monice and Rich now. Because <clears throat> here's the good shit. Now, the reason why I say that this reunion, uh, the reunion finale was fucked up is... <clears throat> let this be the final season? I don't know. Because again, this season started off real good. I'm not going to lie. It started off real good. It, they just lost their way. <laughs> Black Twitter be on it now. But no, here's the thing though, on some real shit. What you mean? What's the tea on the finale? I, I mean, I, I really ain't got no tea. But, look, look, look now. You, you gonna leave Mo alone now, okay? You ain't finna do that. <laughs> but here's the thing. <clears throat> I think what fucked up this season finale is um a lot of this played out on social media before we even got here so it was one of those where we really couldn't sit back in anticipation like monice and uh rich that shit played out months ago so we already knew they weren't together so it was like in watching this it wasn't like oh my god i cannot believe that just happened we knew that shit was gonna happen i'm just happy this shit happened on motherfucking camera you know what i'm saying <laughs> But, <clears throat> I mean, there's that. Um, who else? With the, um, fuck, who else shit played out? You know, fucking Ray J and, um, Princess, you know, being engaged. That shit played out, what, seven weeks ago or some shit like that? <clears throat> I'm gonna try my best to stomach New York. I, don't, I might have to give up on New York. Uh... Don't nobody care about motherfucking cockroach and motherfucking Sylvester. All the motherfucking Looney Tunes. Fuck them. I'm, gl I'm glad they ass wasn't on this motherfucker for that. I didn't even think. I forgot they was even on the mother. Thank you for, for swallowing this shit for me. I was happy not to see their motherfucking asses. Damn it. <laughs> Fuck. But what I'm saying is, like, I think that kind of fuck, you know, the finale up for me, more or less, is this shit had already played out on social media, so it wasn't like none of this shit was fucking new. You feel what I'm saying? But back to Monice and Rich. Now, of course, Rich went the fuck in. We just gonna skip to the shit. <clears throat> was it me? Exactly. Exactly. Suffering suck attached. But, um, was it me or did it feel like Rich wanted to break up with Monique any fucking way and he was looking for the right excuse to sit here and break it off with it? Was it me? Let let me know if it was just me. I just want to know. Because I really do think malnourished Roach. I call him like, who could it cha? I mean, ugh, I don't fucking know. I mean, here's the thing. At least his motherfucking teeth clean. I mean, I mean, is that a plus? I, I don't fucking know. <laughs> you know what he had, but I, I really do think that he was he was already checked out, and I think that this was just the perfect way for him to exit. You feel what I'm saying? What I didn't like is how he came at her. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> 
because he came at her like she was fucking damn um, Erica. I I didn't like that. And then if he loved her the way that he did, he would have. I think he could have been a little more gentle. <clears throat> with how he approached her. Now, what I will say, and I've already said this now, <clears throat> and here's the one thing that uh, really got me, okay? <clears throat> this man sat here and said how he changed for her, and I'm just like, that is where you fucked up at. I did neither, and that's only because <clears throat> something happened with, with, with Monice and either her fa biological father or her stepfather. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> like something happened because if you like, if you see, whenever she deals with men, you know she turns to a little girl. Whether it's the scared little girl that doesn't really want to talk, or just the whole "Oh my gosh," you know, when she's with a dude. So something happened. You know what I'm saying? Something happened with her. But I mean, I didn't like how he came at her, knowing how damaged she was. Like, stop making excuses for. Her. <laughs> <laughs> Look, y'all, I, I told y'all who, who I'm here for, okay? I, I told y'all who I'm here for. I'm Like I said, I, I say when she's wrong, yeah, she should, I, she was wrong for talking to Fizz and shit. I said the shit, but yes, nobody, nobody, again, in YouTube land is even willing to attempt to even give Moniece a fucking crumb. Okay, I'm 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 trying to help, damn it. Okay, I'm trying to help, damn it. But she did. I mean, at this point, you know, let's say it's fucking 2015. We almost 2016. Hell, shit. If you want to be married, shit, ask him to motherfucker marry you. Okay. You just fucking ran my ass, but I'ma let you have that one. I will let you have that one. <laughs> oh shit! All right, all right. <laughs> yeah, they don't. They don't have chemistry. It, I mean, you know what? I don't know if it was necessarily her poker face. I think once she realized <clears throat> that, oh, it was. <laughs> But once she realized, oh, it was you that said the shit. Oh, damn. I need that tea. <clears throat> but, like, once, um, you know, she knew, like, oh, it was motherfucking Tamar's sister, I think she went from possibly about to break down to fuck that. I'm about to fuck somebody ass up. He just broke my heart. Bet I'm about to break her motherfucking face. I think that's what I got from that. Okay. You know what? What I'm going to do is if Love and Hip Hop Hollywood comes back for season three, which I think it is, and if Monice comes back, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give me a fucking t-shirt made, Woody, that says Team Monice. And I'm going to wear it in every fucking video because I'm fucking team Moniz in this bitch better yet if in the event I get with Moniz which I don't see that happen, but if that happens I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna put that in all y'all's motherfucking faces bitch all y'all's fucking faces yeah I'm gonna get the motherfucking shirt done yeah no I ain't fucking panic I'm gonna get the motherfucking shirt done I'm gonna start a motherfucking hashtag motherfucking team motherfucking Moniz I'm gonna fucking do it I'm gonna fucking do it okay you oh shit <laughs> we gonna leave God out of this one right now we we, 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 we gonna leave the Lord out of this <laughs> oh shit you wrong you wrong <laughs> I mean seriously, if we can be honest y'all know I'm not wrapped too tight either okay so I'm <clears throat> just gonna put that out there just gonna put that out there, but no, that T-shirt will be made. I will. I. I don't. I'm. I'm gonna do the shirt now. It's <laughs> a so pop pops. You know what? What I'm gonna do is, 
I, 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 you know what? Cause y'all know they done fucked up my hair. She cut my shit short. I'm gonna let my hair grow back out. Hopefully enough time. I will part the red seat. I will do some motherfucking Afro puffs in here, looking like a broke down motherfucking Amber. Okay, I'ma have that. I'ma have some motherfucking pom poms and all that motherfucking shit. I'ma fucking do it. I'ma fucking do it on y'all asses. That's what the fuck I'ma do. I'ma do it on y'all asses. Watch. I'ma do it. I'ma do it. Y'all, y'all think I'm bullshit. Y'all really think I'm fucking bullshit. I ain't fucking playing. I got no motherfucking shame in this motherfucker. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking do it. I'm gonna fucking do it. <clears throat> Y'all already know I got no motherfucking shame in it. Hey, it is what it is. Team Moniz, right the fuck here. I'm gonna represent if don't nobody else do it. Ooh, you didn't fucking try it. I got three picks in the bag right now. Okay, in the bag right now. And that ain't the reason. That is not the reason. You know You know what? 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 Hold on, wait, wait. Hold on, wait. I got me a cake. Da, 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 da. That's right. That's right. <laughs> oh, shit. Ooh. You know what? The tie we have it on here right now is much better than that motherfucking bullshit ass finale. I just want to fucking say that. Oh shit! I go ahead. <laughs> Can't crusade. Oh shit! Oh help me, help me, Lord. Whew, okay. All right. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> When we can finish up with this. <laughs> oh shit, but we didn't spend most of the time talking about my boo. Okay, my oh, my oh, my boo. Well, thank you for sharing this on Twitter. I mean, hell, I'm gonna say this they probably should have been on here well before. <laughs> One case at a time. <laughs> you know what? I'm probably gonna do a fucking trailer. Maybe. I might do a fucking trailer. If I do, like I said, fuck it. We just gonna cut the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? But I like that we can have a fucking good time and laugh about the shit. I'm not playing by the damn t-shirts, though. I'm not. And possibly about doing puffs and the pop. I'm not playing by this shit. It's gonna go down. I'm gonna fucking do it, okay? All right. Ba -ba -da -da. All right, let me stop playing. All right, so. <clears throat> hey, shit, you know, I mean, hey, everybody needs some love now. <laughs> I've missed this too, okay? I, I have, like I said, the five weeks that I was away, especially like the last three weeks were the fucking worst. I'm probably going to do a um, <clears throat> video about it. I can't, like I said, of course, I can't speak in detail, detail, especially because I know some people that I work with are on my social fucking media. Again, zero fucks to be given, but you know, I still got to be kind of, you know, secret about what the fuck I say. Oh, I know so many cases, so little time. I mean, you know, like I said, I mean, I'm a big pill to swallow. So, you know, like, like I said, you know, I, I got to kind of spread myself a little bit, you know. You know, like I said, I, 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 it's enough for me to go around, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I, I, I'm, I'm a bit heavy, you know, as uh, <clears throat> my sister, uh, Lady Nika, say, I'm, I'm a, I'm a thickums up in here, you know, thickums. All right, back to this shit. Enough of me acting fucking silly. So, Milan. <laughs> oh, the shirt. When I do the shirt, it, it, it's going down. It's fucking going down. I'm going to put a fucking cape on the back of the motherfucking shirt. You know, mm -hmm, yep, I'm going to do it. So, Milan in the studio. Okay, so y'all said, so first and foremost, we're not going to do a poll poll, but let, let me ask you guys. <clears throat> who was the out on tune diva of this episode? Was it Fizz or was it Milan? I'll wait. And I'm going to put some chapstick on because, you know, chap lips ain't sexy. But I want y'all to answer that. <laughs> oh, thank you for sharing that. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Both. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. Y'all so y'all a day. But I love y'all. Okay. <clears throat> Well, he was in the studio. Uh, he could have kept that. 
he 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 could have kept that shit. I was I'm I'm I ain't even trying to hate. He could have kept that shit. Making your hair. Hurt. Has anybody seen Fizz's motherfucking video though? I mean, apparently the song is out. I haven't had time to look the shit up. I mean, but I mean, is the video out? You know, okay, the song sucks. Like I I don't want to fucking know. I don't know. Y'all let me know. Like I said, we we on here just shooting the shit and shit. That's that's what the fuck we doing <clears throat> and everything. <clears throat> But, um, you know, I will say that, you know, <clears throat> I, first of all, is it me or? <laughs> um, <clears throat> well, in general, uh, chap lips are not sexy and I keep at least two sticks of chapstick on me. Okay. I'm just saying, right? kissable lips y'all now but anyway um <clears throat> is it me or does milan and uh <clears throat> miles have strong face people in a motherfucking corner i'm curious because <clears throat> i'm i'm getting tired of this shit like everybody motherfucking strong face i'm just like lord oh my god i'm <clears throat> and i mean here's that we all know that, you know, sometimes females take after their fathers in the fucking strong features department. But hot damn. Hot motherfucking damn. Anyway, <clears throat> I like that he was sharing his story with his uh manager and everything. And, uh, you know, the fact, and <clears throat> like I said in my video, when it comes to kids and whatnot, you know, like I said, racism, hatred, <clears throat> all these different things, that shit is not you know, present in children. They don't know about these things. They don't know about these fucking societal norms and standards and whatnot <clears throat> until it's taught to them. So I thought that it was actually beautiful that he shared that his brother didn't care. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> See, I'm trying to be nice now. I'm trying to be nice. <laughs> But I like how, you know, he was just saying that his brother didn't care. His brother just wanted, <laughs> they are going in. It's one of them, you know, just like, you know, play and everything. And after his brother passed, it further pushed him to just live his life and live in his truth. So, you know, <clears throat> I, I like that too. I really did. Damn, the strong face crew. Fuck. <laughs> I shouldn't even say shit. <laughs> I shouldn't have said a damn thing. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, I'm probably not going to sleep tonight because y'all got my ass on here fucking rolling, okay? I like see here's the I don't know if I'm making y'all laugh, but damn it, y'all fucking making me laugh, okay? This, this shit is fucking genuine. I fucking miss this shit. I do. Oh, it's so fucking nice to be back. Okay. Okay. But that's all that I want to talk about for that. <laughs> It ain't being played a strip club. Wait, may, well, maybe uh, Nikki playing it. Because <clears throat> here's the thing. I refuse to call her Miss Nikki. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, H, K. Baby, I'm not finna do that. The only motherfucker I'm finna say whatever is, and I know y'all probably finna shame me on this too. I will sit here and say Miss Carrie, baby. Miss Carrie Hilson. But I'm not finna call, I'm not finna do that shit with Nikki. Fuck the hell to the no, no. Okay. Mm -mm. <clears throat> I'm about to say, I can't sit here and say Mr. Shit. Because, I mean, hell, ain't none of what's on her fucking feminine parts right now. I'm just saying. But fuck. Not me. Not me. Now, we'll see... My sister lady nigga calls her plastic. I like to call her Tamar's sister, you know. Because that's who the fuck the whole look like, you know. I'm just saying. But I do call her plastic from time to time. Wow. All righty then. All righty then. <laughs> okay, y'all ass is going to fuck in tonight. Okay, okay. <clears throat> so... I was going to talk about Owen oh, April. I'm not going to talk. Yes, they are cutting up. They are very fucking cutting up tonight. <laughs> and when I get a chance, I'm going to do this video. I'm going to transcribe it with the comments, put it on YouTube. You know. <laughs> Tell me what. 
Ooh, we shit. That's good. That's glad. Now nah, mm, that ain't even glad. That's motherfucking, you know, Dollar Tree brand Tupperware right there. Okay. But anyway, <clears throat> let's go ahead and talk about the fucking Fizz's video shoot. Let's go ahead and get this shit out the way. Because, yes, I'm about to sit here and stick up her own knees. It's going to happen right now. Okay. I'm going to talk about it. <laughs> like this all the time. <laughs> Shit. You <laughs> no, I'm I'm not gonna talk about that. I'm going to be nice because Omarion has not been on fuck shit for what it's worth this season up until this last episode. I'm going to give Omarion a pass. I will give Omarion a pass, but I will go ahead and talk about this motherfucking video launch party because that is it. That's that's the very end of all of what I really have to talk about. So let's go ahead and dissect this shit, shall we? So sweep it floor. Lord help me. Lord help me. <laughs> so <clears throat> first and foremost, Sprint Mouth produced the track for Fizz. Let's start there, and let's end there. Moving on. <clears throat> Now, we know Monice only showed up to confront one fucking person. Now, I did not say that. For what it's worth, yeah. <clears throat> now, I did not say this in my video. I forgot to say it, but on some real shit, I did not agree with Monice showing up at this event with the sole intent on checking um, <clears throat> fucking damn. Uh, Tamar, sister. I, I wasn't here for that. I really wasn't. Because it's one of those things where it's just like, when it comes to business, I don't like how some of them act. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, she wants a career, y'all, but... Yes, I disagree with something Moniz did. Look, again, I can be team somebody and still point out their fucking flaws now. <laughs> you can't play on it all the time. Ooh, yes. I said, because that's fucking with somebody motherfucking. Okay, not really fucking with his money. Uh, it's, it's not professional is what I'm saying, okay? So that wasn't cool. I do not agree with that. I do not. I wholeheartedly I don't agree. And I forgot to say that on this on that video, but I'm saying it on this one, okay? So there. There we go. But fuck it. It's good TV. So let's talk about it. <clears throat> so of course she pretty much walks up to uh, you know, plastic wear and tells this whole <clears throat> or better asks her, because she was like, let's get the pleasantries out the way. Were you there? <clears throat> She was like, were you there when I was talking to my baby dad? She was just like, no. <clears throat> but, and when she did the but, she already knew what was coming. You feel what I'm saying? She knew she fucked up. And I understand that everybody was saying that she should have checked Fizz. Now, here's the thing now. I'm all for the whole check your man, check whoever's truly wrong. Because had he not said anything initially, we wouldn't fucking be here. But at the same exact time, nobody told this strong face, manufactured, Mattel ripoff looking ass heifer to go say shit to fucking rich. Ain't nobody tell her to do that. <clears throat> okay. So I was all here for her because I, I really do think she probably gonna get that ass together and then go back. Oh, wow. Well, <clears throat> you know what? I will be nice and I will check out the video in support of Moniz and I may do a uh, review on that. Just going to throw that out there. But she should have stepped to Fizz. But I understand why she stepped to a... Uh... <laughs> but I understand why she came for motherfucking um, Nikki. Exactly, because she shouldn't have even shared that shit at all. You feel what I'm saying? And that, and like, I, it is what it is. But hey, she took it to ass. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> we'll get to that shit in a second. But you know, they talking, you know, doing the whole thing. Now, I will say this shit right here, this shit right. Monice was wrong for that shit too. Okay, yes, she's wrong for a lot of shit today, y'all. She was wrong for that, <clears throat> but it is. But she was in her motherfucking bag. But you can't tell me that she was on the other foot that 
you know, Tupperware wouldn't have been motherfucking mad. You feel what I'm saying? And like I said, she a shady ass bitch in the motherfucking way too, okay? But the fact that she moved her finger out the way, that was one of those where it's just like, come on now, don't do not do that. Now who, wait, who picks and chooses? Are we talking about Monice or are we talking about Nikki? Because here's the thing, Monice seen about it, about it with everybody now. We talking about Nikki. It's not that she picks who, more or less she picks when and where. Not always really who. You feel what I'm saying? I think it's more or less just the... <laughs> but the fact that she was moving her finger out the way, it was like, okay, you antagonizing the beast. And my thing is this, did you not watch last season? Did you not see how she snatched Amanda's ass up? You know what I'm saying? Like, when she grabbed her ass, like, what did I do? Like, did, did, you, did you not see that? <clears throat> do you not see that, you know, Moniece is about that life? You feel what I'm saying? Did you not see that? Did you not catch that? Just saying. So, <clears throat> I forget what she said. We have to break up the vibe and die. <laughs> she, it's, hey, hey, look, y'all. I love a girl that's, you know, trained to go. All right, she trained to get it. You know what I'm saying? Hey, it is what the fuck it is. But I forget what she said, but she throat punched that ass. And I was so fucking here for it, okay? <laughs> oh, she was fucking ready. And here's the thing. <clears throat> Fizz is coming down hard on Moniz, but he not acknowledging the fact <clears throat> that his motherfucker, you know, play doll is contributing to the shit. <clears throat> And then, <clears throat> you know, Brandy jumps in. Moniece was ready for that ass, too. <clears throat> but you see security pull both of them away. Not plastic ass. And then when plastic ass saw that, okay, they got her hut. She was like, she want to try to get about it. And Moniece told her, <clears throat> bring your ass over here. Because Moniece calmed down real quick on that ass. <laughs> but she was real cool about it. She was like, bring your ass over here. Because you, you, you ain't finna come. You ain't finna jump stupid. If you want, if you want this asshole to come get this ass whooped. <laughs> I do believe that she would do some shit like that. <clears throat> but when she threw the drink, and I'm talking about, you know, plastic gas. When she threw the motherfucking drink, you see that Fizz ain't say shit to this plastic ass bitch. Probably because she been paying for his ass and giving him motherfucking money on the motherfucking side, being a motherfucking sugar mama. I think that's what it is. Okay, I think that's what it is, okay? She being a motherfucking sugar mama. That's why he ain't saying shit to her, but it wasn't Moniz that threw the drink. Now, when the drink got thrown, <clears throat> you saw that it took Moniz about a good three good seconds. I think in her mind, she was just like, no, we're not going to do this. No, we're not going to do this. Man, fuck that shit. And when I say she climbed over that motherfucking barricade on that ass, <laughs> on that motherfucking barricade, okay? Come on now. <clears throat> Come on now. What money Fizz got? Don't worry, I'll wait. Exactly. Sugar mom. But when she climbed over that motherfucking barricade, y'all. <laughs> hey, man, you know what? Fuck Tierra. I, I ain't got shit to say about Tierra, motherfucker. <laughs> you know what they did, but she was about that shit, though. She was about to get that ass, though. <laughs> And then fucking Fizz is like snatching her ass back. Like, I just wanted them to let her ass go. That's all the fuck I wanted. Better get fight. I would, I, I would happily pay to see that shit. Happily pay. Happily. Okay. <laughs> well, yes. Thank y'all for them, all Y'all know I ain't got no damn sense. But no, on some real shit, I would pay for that shit. Yeah, he broke. But I'm saying, like, I would pay pay-per-view to see those two motherfucking fight. They can fight a jello pudding, mud, in the motherfucking ring, on my bed. It don't really fucking matter. I would just pay to see the shit. <clears throat> okay, because it's going to be a good-ass fight. I'm putting my money on my knees for many obvious fucking reasons, okay? Many obvious fucking reasons. I'll put my money on my knees, okay? Who would y'all put y'all money on if Brandy and Moniz fall? I want to know. Y'all let me know. I, I Again, my money, it's going on Moniz. All right. It's going on Momo. <sighs> Good fucking time, y'all. Good fucking time. <clears throat> <laughs> you want to see her punching bag going? Okay. 
They scrap it to the end. I know. They will, it will be a good fucking fight now. It will be a good fucking fight. Because here's the thing. I think Brandy is put on crazy. I think she put on crazy. I think Moniece, not even think, I know Moniece is real motherfucking crazy. Okay, because when you have fucking uh, Princess talking about so I'm going to get both y'all ass, she, she made that face and, and then stuck her tongue out, that shit fucking crazy right there. You know she crazy. No, she crazy. I think she is the craziest fucking one on the motherfucking show. Now, on some real shit, I have not seen the previews for next motherfucking week. <clears throat> Yeah, she's very fucking extra. I have not seen the previews for next week now. But, I mean, I'm hearing through the grapevine. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, shit. And, and, and my whole, you know, niece, but Moniece and Jocelyn Hernandez. That's a good fucking question. I mean, like I said, we already know Jocelyn is, you know, manly built. I mean, like I said, I mean, she's a woman, but good, good God almighty, like... It's fucking built now. I don't, uh, I don't know. Like, uh, y'all might be right. I, I might have to give it. To, I might have to say Jocelyn. I, I might have to say Jocelyn will get it, depending. But yeah, Jocelyn. I, I'm gonna have to give it to Jocelyn. Okay, <clears throat> I throw it up. I give it to her now. <laughs> you don't play with those. Oh shit! Oh shit! Y'all know we've been on here for almost a motherfucking hour, cutting the fuck up, y'all. Okay. Hooey. So, <clears throat> I'm hoping that if uh, what I'm hearing is correct, <laughs> that um, <clears throat> princess is gonna break away and she gonna get in somebody's ass. Is what I'm hearing uh, gonna happen at the reunion. <clears throat> Cause she promised an ass whooping, <clears throat> and even what shocked the fuck out of me is you was in the presence of motherfucking Tierra Marie, and you. She, I guess she enjoyed the scene of her and Hazel fighting so much that she ain't do shit. I was just, I was in utter fucking shock, y'all. I was in utter fucking shock, but <clears throat> I fucking digress. <clears throat> So, y'all done made me almost lose my voice on this motherfucking, uh, recap and shit. Are you getting I, <clears throat> I'm hoping that the reunion give me some fucking life, y'all. I really do. I really do. But before I cut off, <clears throat> can we talk about the real households right quick? Is, is that alright with y'all? Can, can, can we talk about the households of Atlanta? <clears throat> I don't know. He might. He might. <clears throat> oh, okay, so it's okay. If we talk. We can talk about the real households. Okay. <clears throat> Go ahead. <laughs> well, here's the thing. When it comes to the real, better yet, I will ask you guys. When it comes to the households. Who team do you think I'm on? I, I would love for y'all to tell me. Who team do y'all think I'm on? House fours. No, whores are classy. We, we're, we're not going to uh, make, make all the asses classy now. <clears throat> so who team do y'all think I'm on? I, I, okay, you say Kenya. Okay, because I, I want to see. I, I want to see how well y'all think y'all know me. Okay, so you say Kenya. Damn, what are you the only one participating in the game? <laughs> <laughs> Proper king because I like crazy chicks. Okay, Kenya. You hope none of them. I am actually team somebody. <clears throat> candy is a candy is a is an option. Okay, well here is the thing. I am team somebody. It was now it was Candy that brought me to the show. Alright, it was Candy that actually brought me to the show. But I'm not team Candy. I am actually team Cynthia. Okay. <laughs> Don't say dumb dumb whore. Not Horsha. Not Horsha. No. No, no, no. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. mm -mm. I can't do the Queen of Thotlandia. Hail to the no no. To the no no no. And and it's, it's like I said, Cynthia is fucking gorgeous to me. 
you know, I like, and I think she is slowly but surely getting her spine off a of layaway. <clears throat> but I, I, I like her. Thank <laughs> God it's not dummy. No. I don't like fake tra Hell no. Uh uh. Uh? Fuck no. <clears throat> well, see, here's the thing. Uh, like I said, if Cynthia ever wants to get out with me, uh, we somewhat share the same last name. Well, it's the hyphenated part of her name. So, I mean, she ain't got to change it. I mean, I just think she married the wrong time. You like, no, 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 would no, what, would it? What? I don't, I don't know now. I don't, mm, I, I can't fuss with you on that. I cannot stand fake your parts. I cannot, I cannot. It, you. You can you can have it. You can have her. She sold her wife for you. <laughs> I had to read that for a second time. I don't I don't think she sold Patricia for a check. I about to say at, at the end of the day, hell, Patricia needs a motherfucking check. Shit. She is the most fake. Fake is the most fake lying ass motherfucker that is on there. Again, when she first come on, she is sitting here lying about a fucking pregnancy. Oh, I tried it. No. No, I did not. She came on lying about her motherfucking pregnancy. So you want to sit here and lie about the fact that you sit here fucking a nigga on a motherfucking air mattress, but then you want to sit here and come back and try to sit here and like fuss some shit because you done got motherfucking, you know pregnant out of motherfucking wedlock and shit so you want to sit here and try to fuss that shit with a motherfucking bullshit ass match miss me with the bullshit no 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 really really we finna do this right now again you can sit here and be for fake drug parts i will still be here for the fabulous stunning thick delicious Cynthia Bailey. Hey, it is what it is. Bar none. I'm still rocking out for Cynthia. It is what the fuck it is. Hey. <laughs> fuck Phaedra. Fuck Phaedra. Fuck Nini. Fuck the Queen of Thotlandia. It is what it is. I'm going to stand in what the fuck I'm going to stand in. I'm going to say what I got to say. Oh, oh, the Bailey Agency. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> so last time. Oh, the shade is real. The shade is real. Yes, yeah, she should have stayed with Leon. Now, all I'm going to say is this. Leon, I, like I said in my video, Leon was telling her to fight for your marriage. He need to be fighting to get that motherfucking ass curl out of his head. I hope that was for a motherfucking um, movie or some shit. I'm looking at Leon like, bruh. Bruh, no. No. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I can't. <laughs> See, <laughs> I, I don't know. Like I said, I can't with Woody right now, okay? Bottle <laughs> company for water. <laughs> wow. Shit, tell me how you really feel. So, so, so what I'm getting from you, Woody, <clears throat> is my fucking love things. You just are not here for them. You not here for Moniz. You not here for Cynthia. Oh, but you do like Cynthia. Mm. 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 Okay. All right. So. <clears throat> oh hell, Lord. Let's. Let, I'm gonna leave that one alone. But let's go ahead and talk about Sheree. I like Marlo. I don't say I love her. I, I, I'm just saying, is there a heart? Is there a, you know... Hmm. I'm, I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. Stand up. Okay, let me let me stop. Like, anyway, let's talk about uh, Sheree and Carlos King. <clears throat> is it just me, or did Carlos really pull the fucking okey-doke on shit by Sheree? How y'all feel about that? <clears throat> okay. I th I think she's almost done paying for it off the layaway now, but you I must admit, when she told Patricia ass, you know, sit your ass down, I was like, whoo, whoo. I, 
felt like Medea for a minute. I'm like, hoo, 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 hoo. Like, that's how I was feeling. I'm like, all right, Cynthia. Yes. But I want to talk about shit by Sheree and fucking Carlos King. Oh, mm, wow. Wow. Oh, okay. The hate is... <laughs> Because here's the thing, like, she comes on the first fucking episode, and I got it, Kenya Moore was being messy, but she turned up so fucking quick, and for what? <clears throat> you turned up so quick to try to get back on this show, and not only did he promise you that he was going to make you a full-time, which you are not, or I guess work to do it, he also stole your motherfucking idea from up under your ass. So he stole the idea, promised you something, and still did not give you what the fuck he promised. Mm. 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 Tur and here's my whole thing. Sheree is not ugly. She's strong face too now. But my thing is this, how you gonna come back on here and you looking basic than a motherfucker? Basic than a motherfucker. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, the hate is strong with you. Not the four strong, the hate is strong with you, brother. Okay. <clears throat> but, you know, it is what it is, <laughs> you know, shit so fucking extra, you know, Horsha, despite the fact I don't like her, I don't like the fact that she is jealous of her sister, in addition to that, you know, it's just like, she like thirsty, thirsty, <laughs> I mean, I don't know, like, I know this shit is starting off real fucking slow, but, <clears throat> All I'm going to say is this. Y'all better be lucky that the motherfuckers from Team Twirl are not on here right now. Because I would have to get the fuck off here and just let y'all go at it. So, I'm just saying. I'm just leave that shit where the fuck it's at, okay? <laughs> but, um, y'all know it's only one thing that I'm waiting for. And I didn't say it. <clears throat> I'm going to say it again. I'm waiting for one fucking thing to show up. And I think it's going to show earlier than expected. Now, I'm waiting for Cynthia Bailey to Chuck Norris kick the fuck out of Horsha. I'm wait, I'm wait for, I'm letting y'all know right now. When that shit happens, y'all best y'all best be waiting for my damn YouTube video. Cause y'all know I asked the fucker, I'ma cut a fucking fool on that motherfucking video. I'm not gonna tell you what I'ma do. Okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you what I'ma do. Y'all just need to know that my ass is going to act a plump motherfucking fool. Because the moment that I see Cynthia Bailey kick this hoe in the stomach, y'all y'all, y'all just better be ready. Y'all, All y'all need to know is I'm going to act the fuck up on that damn video. Sco oh, oh, that's all the fuck she can do is grab somebody by it. She ain't even skull dragging. She grabbed by the hand, fell the fuck down, and then had a motherfucking temper tantrum on the motherfucking floor. Miss me. Miss me. You ain't about shit. You ain't about shit. Okay, and like I said, my thing is, is when you sit here and you want to sit now, mind you, Cynthia has contradicted herself saying that she would never do some shit like that. Probably shouldn't sit here and say what you would never do, but uh, I did not say that because I did not have a YouTube channel at that time, so cannot put that on me. Cannot put that on me. <clears throat> okay. But what I will say is, I don't think that she was wrong for that. My thing is, when you evade the fucking person's space, it is what it is. I mean, granted, she let her get her out of her fucking element. It is what the fuck it is. I'm not saying that she was wrong. I'm not. But what I will say is, again, I cannot wait for Cynthia to sit here and put that boot in that ass. Okay, because it's the American way. I cannot wait, y'all. I cannot wait. 
I'ma act a motherfucker. Like, here's the thing. Y'all need to know that my mom be sitting here coming and y'all done watch some of my videos where I throw random ass shit into the video. I have the perfect fucking thing that I'm gonna throw in this motherfucking video. All I'ma say is when that video happens, just make sure y'all not eating anything. Make sure y'all are not drinking anything. Cause y'all go y'all gonna really look at me like, really? Did you really just throw that in this motherfucking video? That's all I'm saying. <clears throat> Alright y'all, well it's 10.09, I got somewhere to be early in the a.m. and shit. I really enjoy us cutting the fuck up, I really did. <laughs> Bicycle kicks and shit. <laughs> but what I will do is I will go ahead and have this, uh, well, it, it'll probably be done tomorrow, but this video will be transcribed, probably not tonight, I gotta need some sleep, but it'll be transcribed, and it will be up on YouTube for all of us to go back and enjoy, and get some good laughs, and some good <clears throat> kiki hee hees. <laughs> but, he tried me right out, but, if you guys have not, go ahead and check out my video that is on YouTube, I got it up early. As early as I could, and and if y'all are not subscribed to uh, my Facebook fan page, please, uh, you know, subscribe to that because <clears throat> when these early releases come out, more than likely I'm going to post it there. Whoa! Wait a minute. Who started it? I I, I started what? What did I start? We not wait, 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 wait. We 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 go pause right quick. I, I was about to sign the fuck off. What did I start? I'm wait. I'm waiting for this shit. Motherfucker just said I started it. I ain't started shit. <clears throat> All right now, but I'm trying to figure out what did I start. I'm waiting. <clears throat> Whatever. <clears throat> But yeah, I got the Facebook fan page. I'm trying to upload more. But like I said, when I get early releases, whether it be stuff that I do or don't watch, I'm going to post it there. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, and if y'all got any tea to spill, <laughs> if y'all got any tea to spill, that would be the place to do it. So like I said, I'm really working to, you know, do what I can with that. <laughs> But, you know, it is what it is. So, <clears throat> like I said, you guys, Black Ink Crew uh, will be up tomorrow. Uh, like I said, I got some things to do. <clears throat> I go leave on Wednesday. Some would be, I've, I'll, I'll try not to be too much out of the loop, but, you know, it is what it is. So, <clears throat> I love you guys. We had a good fucking time. We wild the fuck out. Y'all gave me a good laugh. I hope I did, but collectively. Y'all crazy. But anyway, <clears throat> I will see you guys later. And I hopefully I get an early release next week so we can come back and do this shit again. And until next time, I will see you guys later. You guys have a fantastic, fantastic night.